This video describes how to specify default credentials with the AWS Tools for PowerShell. The AWS Tools for PowerShell are a set of commandlets that enable you to access Amazon Web Services from the Windows PowerShell command line. All web service requests to AWS must be cryptographically signed using security credentials. To access AWS from PowerShell, you'll need to specify the security credentials that PowerShell should use. The credentials have two components an access key, and a secret key. In addition to the security credentials, PowerShell also needs to know what AWS region to use. You can specify the credentials and the region on the command line when you invoke a commandlet, but it is easier and more secure to specify them with initialize AWS defaults. The initialize AWS defaults commandlet takes separate parameters for access key, secret key, and region. Because the access key and secret key are long, I'll use PowerShell's line continuation character, the back quote, to split the input across multiple lines. For this example, I am pasting in non-functional strings for the access key and secret key. For the region, I am specifying US East 1. I can now invoke an AWS commandlet without specifying any credentials and the commandlet will use the defaults. If I specify a region on the command line, the commandlet will use that region instead of the default. The default credentials are persisted across sessions in a secure store on your local computer. If I start a new PowerShell session and invoke a commandlet without credentials, the commandlet will import the stored credentials into the current session and use them to make the web service request. The secure store is maintained on a per-user basis, so each user of the local computer has their own set of default credentials. If you ever need to delete the default credentials from the secure store, use the clear AWS defaults commandlet. For more information, see the AWS Tools for PowerShell user guide at the URL shown.